Hello there, my name is Mark Barnabas, your data protection pal. Today I'm going to address this question. How do you know if an organization is compliant with the PDPA, or rather accountable for their personal data in the organization? It, we use the word accountable because uh, the PDPC, the Personal Data Protection Commission, focuses a lot on accountability rather than compliance. Because compliance is just like checkbox, tick, 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 tick. So really, it's about accountability and ethical use and responsibility of the personal data held in the organization, in my opinion it is. So this is a, uh, a post made on the PDPC website, or rather PDPC Facebook page, to help you as a consumer or even organization uh, find out if the organization you work with or transact with is accountable. The first question you can ask is if the organization has a DPO, a Data Protection Officer. The second thing you could do is to check the website to see if they've got a privacy policy or a notice. And the third thing you can do is to check if they got a Data Protection Assured or a Data Protection Trust Mark. The DPTM, the Data Protection Trust Mark, is a mark of excellence to indicate that the organization has high standards of data protection uh, within. And this mark is not just uh, a mark that will be given by anybody. It's a mark of excellence given by IMDA and they, have, they will send down auditors to do a very thorough audit of the organization before this mark is given. And every two years, the organization would have to then do the audit over and over again just like how the ISO is done. Now, if you want to find out more, you can go to the pdpc.gov.sg website, the official website of the Personal Data Protection Commission to find out more. And I would like to share with you a, little, a few more questions where you can also uh, check your vendors as well. And why is it important to check your vendors if you are a business owner? Because if your vendor breaches the PDPA and it, the vendor holds your personal data from your organization, you could be responsible for their shortcomings. So it's very important to check on your vendors to make sure that they have good data protection practices and accountable not just for their personal data but your personal data that you allow them to process. So apart from uh, those questions asked by PDPC, I would like to recommend some of these questions. Instead of just asking the company if they've got a data protection officer, just ask them if they have got a DPO. Because if they do not even know what a DPO is, that is a real red flag for you. Because if they do not know what a DPO is, they are quite, I'm quite sure they are not very compliant or not very accountable. The second question you can ask if they've got a work process or SOP for their staff, if they handle personal data, particularly NRIC, and other uh, unique identifiers. The third thing you should do is ask them for their privacy policy or just check their website. The fourth thing is ask them if they are able to comply with the 11 obligations of the PDPA. Now, what are the 11 obligations of the PDPA? They are very important to, to, uh, points to know. If you're not familiar or you're not sure, please uh, enroll for a course, uh, either a one-day course that I run with my colleagues or sign up for the three-day fundamentals of PDPA course, you can ping me or scan the QR code in the next page for more details. Now, the, 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 the question that really uh, hits it on the nail really hard is this. Ask if they have got a DPMP. What is a DPMP? Data Protection Management Program. It's a set of documents that kind of... Uh, it's a guideline for staff in the organization on, on how they handle data, including how they would handle when something goes wrong. So if the company doesn't even know what a DPMP is, if you do not know what a DPMP is, please, I urge you, enroll for a course, be educated, or even educate your team. Uh, we have a one-day course where you can sign up, especially for business owners and professionals, because I know that the three-day course, it may be very long, but a one-day course will give you a good overview. But if you really want to find out more about the details of all the 11 obligations, please sign up for the three-day fundamental PDPA course, because it will be rather comprehensive. So my name is Mark Barabas, and I, will, I hope to connect with you. And if you do have any questions, feel free to PM me on my social media cradles, or even email to me at imarkbarabas.com. 
www.mark.com. So my name is Mark Maravis. I wish you a great journey on your data protection journey. Be safe, be good, protect your personal data, avoid heavy fines, and in fact, it will help you bring some positive branding to your organization. Your organization. So my name is Mark Maravis. See you real soon. Be good, be safe.